depart from me. I never knew you. I ain't even going to lie. That used to scare me too until God truly gave me the revelation of who he's going to tell this to. Now, let me share it with you so you're not scared, sis. Come rock with me. We're going to start in the NIV. Matthew 7, 21 through 23. True and false disciples. Obviously, he's going to tell that to a false disciple. I never knew you. He's not going to tell that to somebody that's truly of him. Not everyone who says to me, Lord, Lord, will enter into the kingdom of heaven, but only the one who does. You got to do the word. You can't just hear the word. The will of my father who is in heaven. Many will say to me on that day, Lord, Lord, did we not prophesy in your name and in your name drive out demons and in your name perform many miracles? Then I will tell them plainly. I never knew you. New means intimacy. You got to have a relationship with Jesus. And if you truly had a relationship with Jesus, watch this. He says, away from me, you evil doer, someone that's practicing evilness, wickedness. You wouldn't be practicing evilness or wickedness if you truly knew Jesus and you were doing the word, not just hearing it, but doing it. Keep rocking with me. This is going to be in the King James, Matthew 7, 21 through 23. He says, be doers of the word. There's a lot of people that say I'm saved by grace and not by works, so I'm not going to work at all for Jesus. And that's not biblical. Works don't save you, but you have to work. If you truly believed in Jesus, you would really be doing this word and not just hearing it. Not everyone who saith unto me, Lord, Lord, shall enter into the kingdom of heaven, but he that doeth, you got to do it. The will of my father, which is in heaven. Many say to me on that day, Lord, Lord, have we not prophesied in thy name and in thy name cast out devils and in thy name done many wonderful works. And then I would profess unto them. I never knew you. Depart from me, ye that work iniquity. Iniquity is evilness. But notice how it said new and new in here. He wants that intimate relationship with you. If you truly have a relationship with Jesus, an intimate relationship with Jesus, and you're not just hearing that word, but you're actually doing it. You're applying that word to your life. You're allowing Jesus to come into your heart and change you as a whole complete person. He's never going to tell you, depart from me, you evildoer, because you wouldn't be doing evilness if you really, truly believed in Jesus and you've allowed him in your heart to change your whole life. I hope this message helped you, sis. God bless you and I love you. Stop being scared. He ain't never going to tell you that.